um, obviously you've known for a while that your team's going to state here, obviously with the, with the Baker finishing earlier this afternoon. Just kind of what's been uh, on your mind since then and, and your thoughts on how the girls played today. Um, they did an awesome job today, and I was just hoping that we could push that through into the individual games. You know, I didn't want to get it all in the Bakers and not have anybody come through an individual. And so having three, the, the top three actually is, is great. Coach or Josh had said that you guys were up after three, and then you're down after seven. Tell me about the maybe was it kind of a roller coaster today, or what was the what was the difference? Yeah, it was. So the I think yeah, like the first three games, um, we we were up like 20 pins, and then they got us like 40 pins, and then 30 pins the next game. So it was about an 80 pin swing there, and then we went uh, 220, and they went 120. So we 100 pin swing, and ended up taking a I think a 50 point lead or pin lead, I guess, and uh, it, we held it at that basically the rest of the time. And in the individual, I think it was, uh, it was th five of the top six were, you know, going into the last game, and you end up with three of the, you know, three of the four qualifiers, and Allie led the way, and Andy and Dakota. And, I mean, what did you see from those girls today? Yeah, they were solid all day long. Um, Allie struggled a little bit in Baker's games, but she turned it on in individuals, shot 660. I mean, that's just that's awesome. And Andy and Dakota both bowled really well in Baker's, so to see them continue through the day was, was good. What are your preliminary thoughts on what you think this team can do in Waterloo? Um, I, I think they'll they'll do just fine. Um, we It'll be a similar shot to like Council Bluffs is, so we, we should go up there and do all right. Congrats. Thank you. The Clorinda girls on to state. I'm gonna ho well, everybody's on to state. All the Clorinda girls are on to state, but individually, Allie, uh, tell me about 660 today. Obviously, I think you came out with a really big one in the first game. What what did that do, and, and what was going well for you? Um, well, I really struggled during Baker, so it was just good to like come back and do decent my first game, and I... I don't know. I just found a place that worked finally and tried to stick with it. And I struggled to do that my last game, but I just picked up my spares and kept trying to get it where it needed to be. And it kind of worked, yeah. What is a, you know, getting a chance to bowl 15 Baker games before your actual individual series, what, what does that do for you? Um, I mean, I was really nervous about like getting worn down before we got to our individuals, but like I feel like it got, gave me a chance to adjust to the lanes and figure out where it was going to work the best for me. How about a team perspective? You guys are on to stay first time ever in Clarinda Girls Bowling history. What's that mean to you? Um, it's really exciting. We got so close last year, and I've been close as an individual to the last two years, so it's really exciting, and I guess, um, I'm, yeah, I'm just really excited. We finally did it. Congratulations. All right, Andy, uh, you get a chance to go to state with a bunch of your teammates as well. What, what's that mean to you? Um, it's definitely, like, really exciting. Um, we missed it last year by 70 pins, so this year getting to go on is really exciting I mean you were you were I think you know probably the favorite they expected to do this coming in it's not always easy to do that though when you have the target on your back what, what does it mean to come out here and bowl the way that you were expected to bowl um it's definitely a lot of pressure on to me um you know I'm expected to do good and it doesn't always happen like that so I'm just proud of myself for well uh what does it say I think it was five out of the top six from Clarinda in the individual I mean what does that say about this program right now um, it's going really well. Very proud of our girls. Um, we've struggled, but we've came back in. And okay, and then uh, I think you were, you were outside the top four going into the last game. Did you have a strong last game? What was what what happened there? Um, my last game was a little struggle in the beginning, um, but I brought it back. Got excited, and I finished good. What about uh, three of the top four? You know, I think it was actually top three. In the individual series, you guys kind of dominating the Bakers. Uh, man, Clarinda Bowling going pretty well. What's wh where does that come from? Have you guys obviously been working at it. No, it was just really good. <laughs> My team, I was really proud of us, and I was glad that we did as good as we did. What do you think about a, a nice long trip to Waterloo? How, what's how's that sound? Really excited for the ride up there. Probably gonna jam out some music, <laughs> and probably take a nap. <laughs> Congratulations! Great job. <laughs> Thank you. Emma Herr is on to state uh, by two pins. Emma, tell me a little bit about uh, just kind of what's going through your head right now. I feel like, I don't know, I thought I couldn't accomplish it until I started believing that last throw. I'm like, I've, I've got this. I guess you were, you were in third heading into the final game. You hold it off by two pins. Tell me about that. Do you, you, did, you told me you didn't have any clue whatsoever. It was just, what, what, what were, what were just like, how are you kind of approaching your, your bowling there late in, the, late in your third game? Um, I kind of just like brushed off all of my other frames and just tried my best. 
You mentioned a little bit about, uh, you know, you're going to Waterloo and you said hopefully my bro your brother will be joining you. Uh, tell me about, maybe did you go to gain a little motivation from what he did this past Friday? Yeah, I really did. I just knew that he was probably sitting there watching me bull and I just felt like in spirit he was here watching me. Well, congratulations and good luck to you in Waterloo. Thank you.